When you're looking for a highly capable, top-of-the-line bay boat, one that includes a fully lined hull and a full complement of enclosed dry storage compartments, the 19-foot Mako 1901 and its larger stablemate, the Mako 2201, are the boats to consider. The liner and hatch lids are molded of 100% composite material for a tight seal and for a long and trouble-free life in a saltwater environment. Plus, the composite gunnels, decks, and cockpit floors all feature a textured non-skid surface for a solid footing underneath. Both models include an enclosed anchor locker in the bow, as well as center, port, and starboard storage compartments. In the 1901, the port and starboard boxes double as extra seating with seat cushion tops, while the 2201 features port and starboard aft jump seats to accommodate extra passengers. The extra length of the 2201 also accommodates an extra insulated in-floor storage box up front, which can double as a fish box, an insulated drink cooler, or for gear storage. And to its left, there's a built-in tackle management system. Both models feature flush-mounted vertical rod holders on each side of the console. The 1901 also features six vertical rod holders along the gunnels, while the 2201 features additional rod storage on both sides of the cockpit and its port bow locker includes rod holders and organizers as well. Perfect for a large crew, or for keeping multiple rods and lures out of the way, but close at hand. Both models contain two bait wells, one below the forward console seat, with the second one located in the aft area. The 1901 features a flip-flop cushioned helm seat with a cooler below, while the 2201 helm includes a cushioned leaning post setup with a cooler below. Both models feature a shallow draft V-hull with a 15 degree dead rise, providing both excellent shallow water navigation as well as confidence when crossing wind and wave-tossed bays and lakes.